Yesterday, I posted a video about the Audi 55 e-tron um, and it's eye-watering depreciation. And it's gone rather well. Um, thousands and thousands of views, most people saying the same thing. But there's one person that caught my eye on Facebook who said the following. I think it's good that these vehicles are cheap now as it means more people will buy them and less people will use fossil fuels. Right, I'm going to cover this. Well, I've covered this several times, but I'm going to cover it once in one, not one breath. I'm probably going to have to breathe in between it. But here's why people driving EVs will use less fossil fuels is wrong. And it is as follows. Feel free to cut, paste, share, do whatever what you want with this rant, because it's the most relevant rant you'll ever get. And it's always oh, my old neighbours there driving past. How weird. Um, and hopefully it sums it up in one very, very short, but very, very necessary sentence. So here goes. The reason that EVs won't stop people using fossil fuels is as follows. The lithium that you need to make the batteries comes out the ground. It comes out the ground with diesel powered excavators. It's then loaded into a diesel powered truck where it's sent off to be dried. Once it's dried, it's loaded into another diesel truck and then loaded onto a diesel boat, where it goes about 5,000 miles to China to be enriched. When it gets to China, it comes off the boat and goes onto diesel trucks or diesel trains. And then it goes to the enrichment place, which is fired by coal-powered power plants. Once it's been enriched, it goes back in the diesel truck onto the diesel boat back halfway around the world to be loaded onto another diesel truck to be put into a battery. That battery is then loaded onto another diesel truck to go to another factory where it's put into the car. Those cars are then loaded onto diesel trucks where they're transported to the harbour, where they're put on a diesel boat, where the diesel boat goes across the Atlantic, lands in Bristol, they get unloaded and they get put onto diesel transporters and sent to the dealership where you buy them. And if you think that in some way you are saving the planet from fossil fuels by buying a milk float you need a lobotomy there i think i've covered it that's all i've got to say future my arse